watching in the bushes, are ya? Oh, yeah, you're out there. Not allowing anybody to get any thumbs up. Or even a view, but you're watching. We know, because you're in the bushes. From sock puppets, and now the sock puppets are too scary because everybody knows all the names. They're all watching in the bushes. Yep, that's what it is. You see, true crimers and all these pedo hunters and uh, predator hunters, I want to know one thing. How many have you caught? Or you're just making reports? So you're a reporter, are you? You're learning journalism. You're a journal, a citizen journalist. Well, let me teach you something about journalism. You're not supposed to take any sides. You're only supposed to report on the matter, unless you might be an analyst, uh, analysis, analyst, an analyst, political analyst. Is that what you are? A citizen political analyst or just a citizen crime analyst. So how many people have you caught? How many people have gone to jail besides Ernie Shelby? Besides Benny Keys? Because they're not the real criminals. They're just YouTubers like you and me. It is not your job to catch any. But if you are making reports... It's quite obvious to me, from Quincy to Kojak, Law and Order to Cagney and Lacey, all you are is a snitch. And you're covering your own ass, so you don't go to jail. And you send your reports. What are they called? Informant, Lionel. You're the word on the streets. You're just being used. And abused. And in actual fact, paid to do what you do. How does it feel to be a loser? Because you haven't caught anyone yet. Unless, I won't be the first time I'm incorrect. So please, correct me. Put it in the comments. Put a name. The only people that were caught were the innocent people that were shot dead by the police. So brilliant, good on you for making people mad on the streets. For pulling their lives apart with no substantial evidence and only hearsay. Karma is a fact. And it doesn't serve up a menu. And luckily, or unluckily, the kitchen never closes. Ciao for now. Please subscribe if you like this video. Give me a thumbs up. Ciao for now. Remember, life gets tougher, but we get smarter. There is light at the end of the tunnel, and that's you. Not, not, not the pedo hunter. It's you who appreciate me and I thank you because you are the light at the end of my tongue and every day I try to be a little bit better to make this life a little bit better Totsin Salane Rahle actually for you Lord let's practice that song yes Swamp Creature song How the Swamp Creature song Glug 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 how do swamp creatures go? Wait, 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 w
We are in stealings of cars. We are selling stolen cars. We are in many things. Selling of organs. Now pay. You may name it. It's us. That's our professions as foreigners in South Africa. Now, tomorrow, when these people stand and fight against such things, now you want to call them xenophobic. And you, as a parent, you, as a father, as a mother, you will not be pleased seeing your only son, your only child, turn into a drug victim. You will not be pleased seeing your only child becoming a drug addict. You will not be pleased to see that it's painful. What you have invested, the school you took this child to, expensive school because you had a hope that this is a future leader of tomorrow. This is a doctor. This is an engineer of tomorrow. But a few months down the line, this person become a victim of drugs. That has been sold by us foreigners. And then when such families stand for these corruptions that we are doing in their country, you want to call them xenophobic? Nah, my brothers, we need to change. We, we need to change. We owe South African citizens an apology. And on top of that, we call them, we call the South African men that they are lazy in their country. The same people who fought for peace. The same people who fought for this country, they won, they conquer. Their economy is moving. We, our countries has collapsed. Destroy infrastructure, poor economy structure, poor leadership. We run to this country with big mouth and say that these people are lazy. If they are lazy, why is our country not looking better than theirs since we are hard workers?